Hello friends, I hope you all are good. So in this video, I will show a little trick. So how can you download a file or video into the client side? So let's see. At first, I just open the CMD and here just run the server. Okay, so now just run the local host and here I just paste a Facebook video link so here is the Facebook video so I just copy the link and here I just paste it and when I submit then it will ask you for HD version and HD version so I just click on HD version sorry for that this also be HD so I just download for HD version so you can see the file has been downloaded into the client site. Okay. So many of case the file just download into the server site means here. Here file also be downloaded but the in the client site the file also be downloaded. So you have to remove this file after some time. Okay so just delete it and again i just run this and here is another facebook video and i just copy this link of this facebook video and now paste it and now submit and it will ask you for hd version and for hd version the cdn of facebook will not block you because this is the local host remember so now just download for hd version so just wait some times and it will download for you. Namaskar. So Amar the file has been downloaded into the client side and also download it into the server side. Here is the manage.py file and here is a video file and inside the video file here is your video. So you can delete it after some time. But go to the download. Here also the videos have been downloaded. So in this video I will tell you how can you do that so I just paste another Facebook link and submit and now download it for SD version so no it will download the, download the SD version for you. Okay. but you have to remember that this site will not work when you host because many times Facebook CDN will block you so I just uh, created it for showing you how can you download any file or any video file into the client site. So you are smart enough to understand. <laughs> so just go to the project file and I just explain it. Uh, so here is the video file you have to delete this. Okay. so at first now this is our project file and at first go to settings just install the app and just here just set the media url static file dis and static url so this is not important and this is our application app and this is the models.py and you can create uh, another field i just create the url field that means when you put the url the url will save into our admin so i just go to the admin and here you can see the url of the facebook video so you already know about that how can you do that so just go to views.py so here is the main thing so i just explain that so this is the home page and this function actually for home page and request to and request and render to uh, index.html so index.html is your template name okay so here you catch the url at first don't for the code i will put the link of the source code in the description box just check it you have to install the request package pip install request then it will work in the local host only okay friends so at first this is the home page and this function for home page and here this function for grabbing url so this function for home page and it go to index.html 
and just go to index.html here is the form so here is the form and now here is the input field and name of the input field is very important because when any user put the link we have to grab this link so just you know already so the name field is very important we use this name here if requested method equal post then you have to grab the url from the name field here is name equal url from this input field so just grab this url so if www.facebook.com in content in this url then url equal to url sometimes facebook will give you short type url so for this you have to convert the lengthy url like this so that's why i just run this try block Okay, so this function will return if HD or HD video available or not. If available, then the ID 0 or 1 will append into the list. Okay, so the list value is 0 and 1. So just go to the download1.html. So just go to download1.html here. I just create a condition if x is 0, that means the HD version is available if x is 1 that means the hd version is available what is x x is nothing but the list this for x in list so i just go to download dot in dot html so here i just put the condition for x in list okay list is the django variable you already see it okay so that is not the main point the main point is what main point how can you download so how can you download any file or any video file from the url so if you click the download hd then it will go to this function hd video download this function hd video so here at first grab the video url and just grab the file size and if file size less than 25 mb i just convert this file size into mb and here is file size request file size request is request.get and video url and stream called true you already know about it if the size less than 25 mb then i just put a file name into date time the file name format is date time okay so here is the main thing so here is the main thing with open os.path.join the join base dir with video file so base dir is what base dir is your manage.py file path so the join base dir with video file so that means this path so here your video will download it into the server site not into the client site so this function this with open is for the uh, download video for the server side not into the client side okay so when you run this just when you run this so it will download the video for server side so i just comment out these two things and also you have to put the file path for the response so this is your file path os.path.join base dir with video file that means the path of manage.py uh, in the join with video file inside the video file your mp4 file will be there so i just copy this path and now here just create a variable data one equal just paste this okay so this is the path for your file okay so now i just copy this data one and here put the data one if i do this it save and then run the server and go to the site and just run the localhost and here just copy the video or file link here and now submit so now download the hd version or hd version so i just download it for hd version so you can see that it will download it but here is nothing okay and also uh, inside the server here you can see that it will download it
side the server it will download it but uh, into the client side it will not download it so I just run it once more so just go to the local host and here paste the URL and just type the submit and download it for HD version and now open it so here is nothing but inside the server you can see that it will download it okay so that's why we have to run another with so just type with and then type the file path wish.path.join then join the base dir that means manage.py directory with video file and then type the file name plus mp4 the path is very important if you did wrong then it will not work so the path of the file is very important and name of the file is very important so now just type with then open and then just type the path of this file file okay so just type the path of this file and now open it with read mode and just uh, type as if then uh, create a variable data equal if dot read and here just remove this and just pass this data here okay so just save it and just run the server and run the local host here just paste it submit and now download it so now you can see the video has been downloaded into the client site so many of people can do till here so they just forgot the one line and this is uh, I not just tell you this is the particular way this is a small trick about that okay so many of people can do till here and they just pass the file with response here but they did uh, they forget about this okay so with open then file open the file at write directory and then read the file and then pass this file and this is the right response okay so just you have to add these two lines and these two lines is very important and you have to pass this variable into the HTTP response not this variable okay so this is the main thing and the same function for the HD video you can check that okay so that's it for the video I will post this project into the telegram and also I will give this I will give the link of the source code into the description box just check it but you have to install the request so you can check it so thanks friends thanks for watching see you in next video and don't forget to subscribe the channel